Water covered large portions of Vigo County last June, making landmarks difficult to recognize. Tuesday morning in one of the hardest struck areas, the United States Department of Agriculture made a huge announcement. $8.3 million. $8.1 million in stimulus money will go toward floodplain easements in Indiana. A big chunk of that will go to fix Thompson Ditch in Vigo County. And then a $3.3 million commitment to, uh, to this drainage area uh, to prevent uh, flooding. The project will raise the elevation of the levees and flood walls to provide protection from a 100-year flood and then some with an additional three feet of height. Uh, if your home is, is attacked by flood, if your business is attacked by flood, everything that's near and dear to you is impacted. And that's why it's important and necessary for us to invest in infrastructure protection. Fixing Thompson Ditch won't only help prevent flooding, but protect the wallets of area residents as well. And we'll also create a situation in which they'll no longer have to pay uh, for flood insurance. The U.S. Department of Agriculture Secretary credits local politicians for making them aware of Vigo County's needs. Politicians like United States Congressman Brad Ellsworth. Uh, we all need to get out of D.C. as much as we can. Certainly that's where we, you know, make the votes and that. But getting back, seeing, seeing the, with your own eyes, talking to the people face to face, that's important. And and thanks to folks voicing their concerns about Thompson Ditch, Vigo County now has the money it needs to fix a major source of flood problems. In Vigo County with photojournalist Tony Casasilla. Jane Santucci, News 10.